here this is my snow x salt spreader i got this for a pretty good price i paid 200 bucks for the spreader the wiring the box everything so this is a snow x it's apparently it's got a new motor the only thing it did not have on it is this like this back bracket here you put in your hitch so we made one i got a regular trailer here to cut the ball part off of it and just got welded some metal onto there then got some four so i got four bolts i'm missing one because i never put it because i never put it in so it fits right in goes right up against the tailgate so you're not spilling a lot of salt it's got the plug there you just got to remember which one's ground and stuff but that's not a big deal i painted it um painted in here a little bit too i don't know why but it's got there's the auger here which is good in this tub i could actually take the tub out and paint sand this down really good and paint all of this really really nice if i wanted to but i don't know if i'm gonna do that just yet i might though i, I need to i wish there was a paint i could use to paint the tub here or maybe if I power wash it, that stuff will come off, or grease lightning, I don't know. Or some paint thinner, or whatever it's called, maybe would work. So, that's my salt spreader. Um, I think it, the guy said it was a 500 pound salt spreader or something. It didn't have a lid. So that was the only, you know, whatever. But, other than that, it's a good, good spreader. So pretty big it's good we use it we use it with bulk salt which is nice and not nice because it's cheap that's the nice part but for these it's a pain in the neck because moisture gets under the tarp and stuff in the back of the truck but that's okay but you can put a lot of salt in this like I filled this like almost all the way up one time and it spread it the whole I spread it in about five minutes it was all gone because I was on blast because I was doing you know Home Depot and they're very picky about it so but that's good it's good because people like seeing tailgate spreaders out on the job and not some walk behind spreaders it keeps the customer happy and the contractor so that's what we were using and another one we had see how it's over by the trash so it's pretty heavy duty, apparently it's got a new motor, I don't know if I already said that or not. But, that's, it's all painted up. I'm probably going to end up doing it, taking the tub off or whatever you want to call it and painting it. So, there's just a review and it needs a new spinner tray or whatever you want to call it. Um, it just seems, it's a little rusted out, so I'm going to get a new one of them. We'll see though, what, you know, I might just get it next year, so... The best deal right here, 200 bucks for a Snow X salt spreader is not a bad deal. So, thanks for watching.